Yeah, that's a, that's has he ever made? No, he hasn't. Okay. Wait a minute. Ooh, is this the? Is this it? Is it time? Is it time for me to get on SoCal PR? Let's go, Aimer. All right, so we got the, the Wolf versus the Olimar. We haven't commentated a Wolf Wally set yet, right? Um, no, we haven't. Nope, no, we haven't. All right, so a little, uh, little salty that uh, we're not seeing the Wolf Ditto. But, oh, you know, no, he got Pineapple. Unfortunate break there for K9S I mean, It's going to be a bad start to, uh, to Grand Finals, but I'm Hip is coming off hot from his victory. Typically, the player sitting at Grand Finals is a little bit more ice, a little right. bit colder. So it takes them some time to adjust. Back here. Oh, dang, that killed at 86. K9 getting these early stocks is what you have to do if you want to be successful versus all You need to abuse that weight. Yes, definitely. Of course, also making good use of the reflector. I've seen K9 like fall down onto an Olimar with the reflector and they up smash. It's so funny. <laughs> oh, why would you do that? I guess some people just don't know. Dude. I mean, but if you're playing Olimar, you should definitely know like the weakness of your own character. Yeah. Ooh, the parry. Into the pun is there. Clean stuff coming out from I'm Hit. Of course, doing his three hit combos, racking uh, I'm Hit to 60%. Yeah, Kanai's Wolf is nasty, dude. I like that he's, he's knowledgeable enough about the character and, like, in his playstyle that he takes what he can get and then just resets or sets up for a tech chase. Yeah. So we'll see him, like, often go for, like, three-hit combos, like fair, fair, up air, or fair, up air, up air, or something. And then he just, like, fishes for his next hit. Right. There's like maybe a like a stalling there just get like that tech chase situation or F tilt. Yes. Oh man, but uh, K9 is uh, looking grim for your boy K9. That's right. Forward throw, taking the damage. But oh, you got to be aware of what Pikmin's flying at you. you don't want to get hit by those purples because it does send you into tumble and make you give up your position. Yeah. Oh, no dash attack. Finally paying off here for K9. All right, I'm hip is just. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay. Opting for the forward throw. Okay, there it is. Oh, for some reason I thought that was him down airing. I was like, <laughs> how is that killing all of them on stage? Like, wait a minute. What is that face that I'm hip's doing? Okay, he's not doing it anymore. So yeah, you're gonna pick up sword or shield. Oh, I feel like I'm like on the spot right now. <laughs> uh, it depends on which one has better Pokemon. All right, I can respect that. It's a, it's a very meta answer. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Pokemon Stadium two, we go and, and wow, oh, no, we're not. Forced, forced SD from K9. I like yeah. the strategy. Yeah, these down tilts at on the platform are very. I heard they true combo in SD. They they're oppressive. That's what they are. <laughs> Definitely seeing the true combos. Nintendo needs to patch that out because that's game breaking. Huh, I wonder what was wrong. Uh, maybe hit him with the swift. No. <laughs> wrong character? You want a counter pick? Maybe. No, it's Correct like colors? Like Correct colors, I guess. Dang. Maybe they just wanted to waste our time. That I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got Olimar versus Wolf here. Okay, I thought they were button checking for a second. Just with the way that I'm hit. Started by throwing off his po his Pikmin, just so he could like pluck out a white one. Right. And then uh, K9's jumping. Just jumped. Ooh. Oh, again, the down pass going to catch that ledge drop, double jump. A much better start for K9 here in game two. Yeah, I feel like 
going for the like slay the pigment strategy is like it can work but at the same time I'm like man is this even worth it like he's gonna spawn more yeah he has a endless supply <laughs> endless supply endless he's a, he's a commander with no remorse for his soldiers Dang, that raw side view just worked. I mean, raw, what flashes that that sweet spot? Especially like when they're on stage. It's, it's like closer, the hype. It's like closer to the commentary. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like if you're looking at like a, I guess like a setup. Uh huh. Yeah. Wait, what was the question? <laughs> I actually forgot the question. <laughs> that was Wolf Lashes on stage. That's oh, spot. that is nothing to do with real life at <laughs> all. Wow. I'm actually tight that I answered that. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Ooh wee. All right. Well, <laughs> F tilt not going to work. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, this, this, this is gonna go. Yeah, right. the swiftest of back throws. <laughs> Canine only resorting to half his cunning. Maybe he'll use all of his cunning in the next game. It's so funny because I just answered with such confidence. <laughs> I like, know you were you were like, I'm clearly right. <laughs> and, yep. You got it, Korean. <laughs> I was just you know, I was just gonna leave it. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say anything. <laughs> like I, I could even I could tell too I was like something's not right here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright, so we got last stock here, Pokemon Stadium 2 the Wow I'm surprised. Uh no, ooh, I like the reset can I went for after the delayed nair. Tried to go for that grab, would have been so much damage, but barely missing it. And both their characters kinda getting their bread and butters out the way early. Now we're sitting here like 70%. Mm -hmm. Double blue? No, no, one of one of the blue guys. I mean, we, we got a blue and a purple though. Yeah, and uh oh, uh oh, oh, gotta slash that thing off. And I like the how I'm hip is just creeping in on Canine space, and Canine was slowly giving up stage control as he was like trying to maintain that distance between the two of them. Yeah, it's like he knows that as soon as as soon as I, I get gets a little bit too close, that's when those, these big aerials with these purple Pikmin are gonna come out. Yep, now we got two purple Pikmin. That is a very, this is probably the strongest lineup in the game. We're gonna get a down throw here, maybe an F-toe. Oh, no, the purple go Pikmin's the gone, or the, the, the blue one's gone, so no grab setups. No. Back here, cross up. All right, so K9 has Bruce get himself on the board here. And he had to work hard for that one, especially like when you think about how good of a start he had the game too and yeah. he pretty much zero to death i'm hip and only took i think he took like 11 percent wow really yeah like that's how much of a lead he had in the beginning dang yo when are, when are we gonna legalize brinstar deaths again wait <laughs> are you talking about the, the one where you break the stuff or? oh wait no with hazardous you don't right no you don't you don't have hazardous so. Dude, I don't know, man. Everyone said that stage was whack. It is whack. But you know what? <laughs> Apparently, we, we need some, some whack stages to, to liven up our stage list. So my vote for Brent Star. You know what's funny? It's like, yeah, we, we should get more, like, whack stages. But, like, whoa, whoa, whoa we're, we're adding more stages. We need more bands. So all those whack stages we added are going to get banned anyway. Oh. Okay, able to make it back. Likely a tenth from I'm Hip. Showing he's not afraid to throw out the down air and punish K9 hard. Yeah. Back air, gonna get the whistle though. Yeah, there's a normal get up, getting caught. Even burning the second jump to land a couple, or just a single hit, attacking a little bit of extra damage. Ledge jump whistle seems the way to go here for Allmar, but K9 just punching it every single time. Oh, I like the tomahawk from K9. He is definitely a smooth bin. Another one, Tech Chase does get it with the dash attack here. Oh, collecting that purple pick, man, it's I, gone. Yeah, I like it too because if, even if it doesn't like necessarily hit Olimar, he's just getting rid of it. He doesn't have yeah. to beat it up because they have a lot of health. It's reflected right off the stage and they ain't coming back, man. Oh, wow, the dash dance into dash attack. 
Why, why is that kill? Why? why? <laughs> oh, mucho damage. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, you know, I just wonder if he could have gone into Dare there. Oh. I'm try to get the wolf flash right after, but does not connect. I mean, does that even have a follow up? Because like, you can't do anything after wolf flash, right? You just go into free fall? Yes. There's things that like combo into wolf flash. With like the right DI and all that jazz. But other than that. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm hip able to bring the stocks even. And wow, reflecting the red Pikmin right back to I'm hip. Okay. Ooh, there's a tech chase and lots of damage once again. Wow, did you see that shield damage? Oh, yeah. Marbled size. Yep. Purple, man. Oh, there's the back air. Okay. And it looked like K9 was actually reaching a little bit with that, with that double jump back air. That was a deep back air, but it was a it was a call out nonetheless. See down throw dash attack, easy stuff, easy oh, damage. And he almost got the reset with the fair as well. Oh baby. Oh okay, good damage, good damage. Oh with the whistle, He's gonna get I'm hip out of that situation. Man. Yeah, good reversal. And uh, it even resulted in him, like, taking stage control. Yeah, which is, like, very snowball as well. So, or just holds your opponent's momentum. Yeah, but K9, not, not afraid to rebuild his momentum or even just reset back to neutral. He has a blaster. He's comfortable with just chilling back. Not to mention that the blaster will kill, what, four or five of the Pikmin? Four out of five of the Pikmin? Yeah. Man, he throws the blue, but he definitely needs the grab with the blue. And K9 is taking these trades all day long. Where is the down air? Come on, K9, do it for me. Do it. I don't know. Here it comes. Go, I believe in him. Going, oh. going for the down air in this matchup. Oof. Big yikes. He's he's got like almost max rage. I'm hips at a really high percent, and he has an extra stock. If there's if there's a time to make the play. Yep. Go for those those hype hype game uh, game enders then th that was the opportunity and then that's how you get baited into doing those yeah then you'll be like that's, why that's am I why i'm not in winners <laughs> grand finals why did, I, why did i do this <laughs> and then you just you just think about it and, and you lost the game already yep oh, oh man he's so scared oh, down, down smash should do it here <laughs> yeah okay i was wondering if he was gonna stall out long enough because he did do the air dodge back. Right. He was recovering to the other side. Maybe if he was like able to ride the stage of uh, long enough to where he would get his invincibility back. But right. he got punished with the re-grab. Well, 2-0 K9. No, 2-1, right? 2-1 K9. See, I remember something. 2-1 <laughs> K9. Yeah, we'll see if K9 can uh, bring it home here with the 3-1 victory, or possibly I'm Hip could possibly bring us to a game five situation. So, oh, and possibly reset the bracket and too. Possibly reset the bracket and possibly make another game five situation. Last off, last hit, timeout. <laughs> so those are all all of the possibilities, pretty much. Anything is possible, but let's see how much cunning K9 brings. We see a good start for, for I'm Hip. The last couple games have been explosive for K9 in the beginning, but this one, not so much. Yeah. Well, I like the down throw laser there. Very safe option. Resulting to result, resorting to using the whistle from the, the ledge option again. Oh, yeah. That, that whistle is such a great tool. Whenever you get hit in that disadvantage, you have that armor out, which is like... Amazing to have. Oh man, you gotta watch out for those purple. The purple smash attacks do so much shield damage. Gotta watch out for those anti-air up smashes too. I'm uh, K9 likes to jump around. Yeah. And we even saw like that that empty line into the up smash, calling out the defensive jump from shield. I feel like it's a very common situation. Everyone like someone gets crossed up, and you're like, "Oh, I can't punish you, so I'm gonna jump and then try to cross you up," and then the cycle. Well, good luck crossing up Wolf's up smash. It hits both sides. Oh, yeah. So, so good. Not as quick as other up smashes, but it is pretty quick, and it does cover both sides as well. Mm. It makes it really, really nice. I like how just the the reaction time from I'm hit is 
as soon as he sees the Pikmin getting reflected right back at him, he just immediately whistles. He actually doesn't take any damage from it either. No way. He's just so fast. Dang. What if, what if they're lashed onto you? Can you whistle them off you? That'd yes. Be, that'd be that's, a, that's actually what he was doing. <laughs> that's broken. What's the, uh. All right. <laughs> All right, Olimar. You got it. <laughs> I like the down smash charge there, covering multiple options. Who is going to pull ahead this game, though? Even percents, but we see a couple of jabs, and now percents are going in I'm a Hip's favor. Oh, the get off me. Take this shot, too. Shoot him up. Wow, yeah, it's doing damage to Pikmin as well. Oh, this is this lineup, though. Two purples and something else. And a red. Two purple and red. Oh, reflecting the purple right back. Smart. I guess that is the one the one time that uh, I'm Hip wouldn't be able to use his whistle is when it's reflecting like a purple Pikmin. Because right. it doesn't latch, it just like straight up knocks you off. Yeah, you just get bodied. Ooh. Oh. And can I still holding on to the second stock as well? Like, like the dang. Just as I say that, he's able to seal it out versus I'm hit. Ooh, but we do have the purple on uh, in the lineup, so, you know, K9. Oh, no way. What? <laughs> what? What, uh, what percent was he at? Thank you, Wolf, oh. dude. Wolf the homie. <laughs> dude, it doesn't matter what percent you are. You're just... I, I've killed you people at like die? 10 percent. Yeah. Is that because of Max Rage? Uh, dude, that move is just, just that Wolf strong. Wolf Flash is just that good? Well, yeah. You know... It, it, Don't it, smile it, at me it, like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well. Yeah, I mean... And honestly, like, I think K9 actually baited him to do that. Like, he... He kind of faded back with the side B, and he was like, try to edge guard me. And yeah. then he, he adjusted the angle and spaced it just like that's with right, the perfect you, micro spacing. You can't adjust to, the angle, that's right. To get the spike. So I'm totally lying. He, he probably just wanted to recover. I mean, we had we did <laughs> see that I'm Hip was, was willing to go off stage, especially with those down <laughs> airs, um, to try and like put pressure on K9 or possibly right. get a spike. He, he did hit him. It's like he, it's he like got it. It's like Sheik, man. Sheik and Smash Yay. Four. You're like, oh, hey, I'm trying to recover. Oops, you died. Yeah. Might be. Oops. I got back on stage though. <laughs>